the Earth, broken into a million shards, forcing its steam-driven inhabitants into space. Hard-working folks known as cowbucks survive by farming moisture and mining what little land is left, constantly dealing with all sorts of space jerks. There are the gangs of scrap metal meanies roaming about, preying on the weak and completely disregarding basic manners. Then there are the diesel-driven royalists, a bunch of oppressive bullies, abusing their power and bleeding the cowbots dry. To top it all off, there are rumors of something far more dangerous stirring in the depth of space, waking from its age-long slumber. These are the descendants of a shattered planet, and this, my distinguished gentle bots, is the new Steam World. There we go. <laughs> Better to check each time now that it actually records. And ahoy there, everyone. Welcome back. Uh, <laughs> there. Ahoy, everyone. Uh, I'll be your Captain Hillian today, along with... Is the mighty Lieutenant Rakir at your service. And you look a bit choppy, Captain. Uh, uh, okay, I see. It might, could be that the game is drawing a bit more than it should, or might, whatever. And uh, yeah, welcome to SteamWorld Heist and hello in chat, Marco. How are you doing today? Marco! <laughs> Okay, now this, of course, is the... If, I'm not entirely sure if the, it takes place in the same timeline as the previous SteamWorld games. If, but I don't like... So I think, I think you said that there are going to be links found to the previous games. So yeah, it is a sequel of the series, but it's not a, it's not a direct sequel to Dig 2. Okay, also, of course, it plays very different as we'll get to see soon. We did a showcase of this game a year or two back. And, yeah, yeah let's get started. The Outsider Unlocked. This content is scattered throughout the game. You can find a new character near Chop Soup. Okay. Let's see, casual. If you're not used to turn-based strategy, or if you're more interested in the story, if you want a lighter challenge, this setting allows you to go in with guns blazing. Okay, it shows stats for each of these. Experience presents a challenging experience for a typical player. West, no, no, I almost said Western, it's veteran. Our favorite setting recommended for advanced players requires expert use of weapons and abilities. And elites, the ultimate Steam World Heist challenge, there is no room for mistakes. Let's just go with uh, this one. Yes, as we be a we be common, uh, contacting Faraday, all that. Notorious smuggler and occasional pirate is having a rough time. A brutal gang of thugs called Scrappers are spreading across our turf in the outskirts, stealing everything in sight. They have even been known to kidnap the locals. Their presence could draw unwanted attention from the Royal Space Force. In short, they are bad for business. Low on water, Piper and her mates have boarded a scrapper ship, aiming to relieve them of their ill-gotten cargo. And of course, it all went according to plan. Of course, it went not. <laughs> Blast, this did not go according to plan. <laughs> Let's see, Marco, I'm good. I remember playing this on my 3DS. Okay. <laughs> What a positively macabre place. Okay. What does she make me think of a commissar? <laughs> it's the hat. Probably. Oh. Hey, fellas, you all right? <laughs> you wanted to say something? Oh, uh, uh, I decided to be quiet uh, to let you read. Okay, you can say after we finish. Right, better get up there and help out. Okay. Right, I want to say and... you're right, then. You're still being choppy. What? Okay. 
My whole cow bot down here. Ain't I lucky? Mind if I help myself to some of your water? When I'm done with you, I'll use it for spare parts. <laughs> you just try it, bub. And yeah, as is very obvious, uh, the game may still be a uh, 2D, but it's now uh, <laughs> it's now XCOM. Okay. Yep. yep. 2D XCOM. This is a interesting combo. Yep. Okay, we can continue moving on. And enter. Okay, up and over there. Alright. Open that up. Good. Turrets. Fancy security for Anka Junk. But I can cover behind that shut up barrel. Yeah. Let's do that quickly. There. I won't be able to fire after a sprint like that. I'll, yeah, I'll just have to wait my turn here. Okay. Right, my turn. Better amp up my gun so I can take that turret out with one shot. I don't want to trust another go covering behind this thing. Yeah, it already looks like it should be... <laughs> it's more whole than... Uh... How do I... Oh, okay, I see. It's not hold, it's switch between. Okay. There we go. Yeah, that, that, that bell is more hold than barrel. <laughs> okay. Yeah, when we showcased this game, I wasn't using a controller. So I'll need to, I'll need to get used to this a bit. Nope. Oh. <laughs> Um, hello there, Jess, and thank you for the raid. Uh, shouldn't we have had a sound effect for that? <laughs> uh, we, uh, wait, we did have a sound effect. Yeah, that was for follow. <laughs> there it <What> is. The <laughs> okay, that's a new, or, or wait, did... <laughs> okay, so... <laughs> that... Okay, so I saw the pop-up of the raids in, the, in stream chat, hello, by the way. And at the same moment, someone followed. Uh, Dot Raid TV, thank you for the follow. I don't know if you came along with the raid or somehow ran ahead of the pack. But, uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And thank you, K Money P uh, uh, FPV. And, yeah, hello everyone. I'm uh, Captain Hillian. Over here is my co host, Rakir. Sorry for being uh... a bit choppy. And, yeah, we generally stream a variety of games, typically mostly for the story. Uh, though we do do some multiplayer and against every now and then. And uh, yeah, currently we're streaming SteamWorld Heist, the fourth in the series total, even though the fourth one is basically Lost Media, I believe. So technically the third now. Uh, let's see. Jess, l let me give you a shout out quickly. I thought you had one ask. Is how many are you looking shocked at you all? And on that same matter, is the. How is the. How's the audio balancing? Because for my, from what I'm hearing, the game is a little bit loud. Okay, now uh, you look so normal. Yes, so I guess the game that's more you're not uh, able to explain. Then I ask me wonder, what the heck is that game doing to draw so much power? Mm, not sure. And let's see, sounds good. Okay, good to hear. And you were playing Once Human. I've heard a bit of mixed things about that game. Uh, but yeah, can tell you tell me what you think of it? Uh, da -da -da, who this? Yo, yeah, I love these games. The Mao, I did. Uh, okay, so Dot Raid ran ahead of the pack, it seems. Uh, okay, I'm just going to chop it up to OBS being a brat. Sea Brass. You took your sweet time, Captain. And here was coming to save you and all. Where's the rest of the crew? <laughs> They got scrapped and hauled off. I'm the only one left, Gyark. Dang it, we need to get out of here before we end up in some scrap heap. Aye, aye, Captain. Okay, get in to cover you, and now we have two characters. Let's see. The brass. Okay. The brass oh, does kind of sound a badass, but he's also a pun. 
Okay, so the captain has a laser sight, but uh, <laughs> Seabrass does not. Okay. I do like that there is some sway in it, so you can't pick, you can't just uh, line up a perfect shot. Can I just... No, I cannot move in behind him. If I move here, I'll just put all the shots in this in the barrel. So... Yep, wrong button. Yep, <laughs> we shot his hat off. Okay. Can we actually take aim from here down? Okay, yeah, we, the barrel does not block our shots. Yep, wrong button. There we go. Uh, let's see. Uh, yep. There's our way out. Let's do one of their escape pods. Let's see. Dot raids. Zombie spray for brains. It's so good. Uh, <laughs> if, if you said something about that before, I'm not seeing what. Uh, K money. It's free. It's good. It's like 7 DTT. And, oh, right. Uh, <laughs> one human. My bad on that. Uh, and Power World mixed with dungeon grinding. Jess, I find it addicting and fun, but I'd say it's heavily depends on the person playing, I say. It's close to a mix of Valheim, who plays the Viking team with Apocalypse and Zombies, and Power World. Uh, Marco, it's a remake... Uh, yeah, but it's a remake of a 3DS game. I think they got more content, so it maybe you're taking up more of your CPU. Possible, and I only just now noticed that the mouse is over here. Uh, yeah, All right, I, I yeah, I forgot to, to I forgot to put the source below the overlay again. Can we go to the options <laughs> to see if there's a set you can fix there? Maybe you'll after this chat, so we don't skip it accidentally. Yeah. So it's with. Okay, that was simple. Uh, let's confirm guard. Could be V-Sync. Let's see. Yeah, it was! Yeah. It's always the freaking V-Sync that either breaks a game or somehow fixes it, isn't it? Also, yoink. Yeah, y usually breaking. Okay, not a good spot to be in. Okay. Okay, open that up. Oh. Okay, should have expected that. Okay. I do gotta say that these scrappers actually look pretty menacing. Yeah! Ooh, what the heck? <clears throat> okay, well, this is just straight up an execution. Yep. I, I keep pressing right trigger expecting it to be fire because it tends to be the fire button, doesn't it? Okay, I'm, I'm guessing that fist means that if we get too close that uh, they'll just attack us. But I don't think captain. we have much of a chance of missing this. Oh dear. Uh, but uh, Captain, if you want, I can voice act with Zebras. Okay. Uh, can we? Can we? Yes, we can. We can just also, do. We can just do the uh, naked gun thing. We're just hiding on the same on, on different sides of a barrel. Oh my God. Uh, you can't even do another XCOM. And also. Did, did you try Irish accent earlier? Yep. Emphasis on try. I mean, don't uh, blame you. Yeah. <clears throat> Trying another accent is easier if you practice with it. Yeah. <clears throat> and it also helps if my throat isn't trying to kill me for some reason. Okay, in turn. That also helps. This round collected 100%. Let's see. V-Sync, you motherfucker. Fist is physical. Swab hat. This bow bowler might be a bit worse for wear, but it's still uh, stylish, right? Anyway, it's better off than freezing... <laughs> it's better than freezing your scalp off. <laughs> and the swag bag, which is... Oh, water. Okay. And one of the greens. Okay. Swamp hats usually even look stylish even when they are bloody torn to almost shreds. Yeah, uh, okay, I still want to get point, a bowler but... hat at some point. <laughs> <laughs> the the best hat that I have at the moment that isn't like a, a cap is like 
It's not really a fedora, but it's close to one. Hmm. You also have one of those? <laughs> yes. Uh, I like that the experience is shared among the crew. Welcome back, Captain. Dang it, Wonky, we won't get any work done with these scrappers hogging everything in sight. They're no good, steamed maggot, or even pilfering their parts of honest cow cowbots. I must say cobwebs. <laughs> we'll have to do something about it. They hauled off most of our crew back there. Oh, yeah, I'm still here. Regrettably. <laughs> With the water shortage, it's a, it's a tough spot, no mistaking it. This puts us at skeleton crew, quite literally. What am I, invisible? We didn't even get that much water. We'll need more gallons to get back on our feet. We'll have to figure something out. Okay, ma'am. Just set the course over it on the map table and they'll get us moving. Okay, let me check something else as well. Uh, let's see... Skip info, intro... No, direct aiming... Hmm... Okay, I, I, was, I was half thinking that the some of the tutorials were turned off, but I think we'll get to those in the next level here. We need to find some more gallons. Okay... Filling up. With nothing but ripper okay. class... But... You, you could you have were able to talk to your crew more. Okay, look, yep. ah, I see. Yeah. Getting prepared should be high priority, ma'am. Grumpy old zebra, <laughs> zebras might be a capable fellow, but we're not fit to handle all these scrappers. <laughs> we'll just have to we'll just have to round up some more gallons. I'm guessing we'll get... No, we're, we're getting more crew later on anyways. Golly, that went bad. Those patchy bald heads had me staggering. Yeah. Makes me squeamish about body being worse than it does. I don't feel much like ending up in some scrap heap. Where at you are, sailor? Run, 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 run. <laughs> Uh, right. uh, let's see. With nothing but ripper class scrappers aboard, this tiny vessel should be easy pickings for even for a small and desperate crew. Grab as much as possible and get out. And it looks like we'll have a maximum of five uh <clears throat> a maximum of five characters that we'll be able to bring. Probably the captain will be a permanent one no matter what. Okay, collect swag and get the hell out. Okay, <laughs> new hat. A ship requires many things, a captain, but uh, 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 but one proper headwear to show who's boss. Who's the boss? You're the boss. <laughs> but we can actually swap these around. <laughs> Let's keep that one on and give him the bowler. <laughs> okay, then we can select between weapons and some other stuff. Utilities. Okay. Scope Smuggler Special. Default. Junkyard Shotgun. Your default scoped compact gun with smart aiming, used if no other weapon is equipped, requires no inventory space. And yeah, utilities will help you during missions, equip them from your inventory. Each gear provides different support, so choose wisely. And yeah, your default scatterer, decent spread but low accuracy, used if no other weapon is equipped. Okay, let's just get started. Yeah, we already learned that game. Yeah, let's see, Marco, the thing is, like, that you can talk to you for, yeah. Can you hear me? It's Wonky. I've hooked up to some exposed plumbing on this uh, ship, so now I can speak to you. It should be an easy mission, nothing like that last one. Just grab all the gallons you can. Oh, and if you should come across any epic swag, make sure, uh, make sure to bring it back. Okay. Okay, immediately hide. You, you can hide here. I like that. Okay. And, okay, what's grayed out, we won't hit. But what is uh, colored in or isn't grayed out or darkened out, whatever. 
uh, what isn't what is highlighted that will get hit so this would be a bad shot so maybe with some luck nope i can okay i was kind of hoping to bounce a shot off of the middle but makes sense that it passes through okay there. Uh, she can do that. Uh, you can see how it will do, do that, I guess. Yeah, but I'm presuming that the other shots will also bounce. It is just a lot more of a gamble. Though this isn't much of one. But that was point blank. Look over here. Sea brass. Okay, there's some stuff. See this? Okay, that has a cooldown. Plus one damage. Two to four damage. Okay. Okay. You get closer. Guard. <laughs> there goes her hat this time. Okay. I just realized there's something else about her that looks familiar. What then? Especially now when her hat flew off. Iron Man. <laughs> or it is the same uh, color pattern, not similar one. No, this is, I guess you would say, Iron Woman. I guess, yeah. Uh, let's see. Can I get... Yep. Nope. I was trying to do to the other one oh, yeah. that was done to the captain just now. Let's see. Can I? How fancy can I be with this shot? Okay. There. Oh, I think, uh, I'm gonna do something in place. I get it. I'm gonna send yes a hug. And uh, Marco confirms that shots do bounce, even the ones that aren't, well, aimed, or aren't with a laser sight, or scope, or whatever. Okay, grab that. Let's see, let's team up over here. You get your hat back. <laughs> hat off, hat on, pick up a hat after yours has been shot off. <laughs> okay, wait over there. Okay, wait. There you go. I'm back. I'm back. Nice. Okay, and that's all there is in this one. Okay. I think there is Mitchell Swag. Yeah, I'm grabbing that with the captain in a sec here. There. I like that it still uses the same sounds as from the dig games. Let's see. I'm not seeing anything on the mini map that might show something. Is there or I'm not? Okay with it as well. I'm a bit mixed when it comes to reusing assets. It depends a lot on situation. Yeah. Okay. Going to rush around for this one. You stay there. I'm asked. Okay. Hello there. <laughs> okay, I was expecting to need to get another shot in with sea brass here, but nope. Okay, and that's all. You should have enough water by now, and we don't get paid for wrecking scrap. Just pocket all the swag and head for an escape pod. Okay. Oh dear. And there we go. Yes. Yeah, basically, that's the game telling uh, if you've got all the gear, don't waste time <clears throat> getting more kills. Some water. Grand prize, a hard to come by goodie. 
It would most certainly contain something more powerful than your average swag. Plus one reputation as well. Okay, new pistol that does one more damage. A primitive but accurate lead spitter does what it's supposed to. And it says a value of 125 gallons. Okay. Okay. And that's levels for everyone. Okay. Let's see. B new battle experience has taught this crewmate a new ability. Okay. Plus one health. Okay. Our sea brass has payback. Vanguards become enraged when taking damage. When enraged, their next attack will deal plus two bonus damage. Okay. So different classes and all that as well. That should be enough water. Let's head for Gat's bar and spend it. Yeah! I do like a new cannon! Give me a trust worth a gun any day over an inexperienced crewmate! I thought we weren't welcome at Gat's anymore. Well, now we've got gallons to spend, and Gat's not an unreasonable fellow. Uh, I think we've got enough water for now. Let's swing by Gat's bar and see if we can get what we need. Right, I just might have to charm Gat a bit. Okay, I think this is about where we got where, with the showcase. You okay there, sailor? Yeah, this whole thing makes me... Yeah, this whole thing makes me steam boil. I'm so angry, I couldn't strangle a whale. Heck. That's horrible, Gabriel. Such... <laughs> <laughs> Such majestic creatures. You never met a whale, have you, Captain? Mm, not really, no. Just the eye creatures, a lot of them. Only good thing about them, they are dripping with oil. Okay, are yeah, we from Irish? talking? Are you so gone? Uh, I get the. Are we going to get space whales or something? Probably. And I feel like I'm going more pirate than Irish, which probably is, you're supposed to speak more pirate with him than Irish. Perhaps. Gat's bar. This is Gat Parrot's bar. He's not too fond of smugglers, but he's not an unreasonable fellow. Again, in the background, we just have the shattered earth. Okay. I thought I told you to stay clear of this establishment, Faraday. You sure did, Gat. I just need to stock up after a rough scuffle with some scrappers back there. I've got gallons to spend. Just let me pick up what we need and I'll be out of your scalp. Ugh. Last time you left with a bit more than you paid for, but I could act but I could actually use your help. But golly, now I've heard everything. The scrappers have hit us all hard. They even kidnapped Mosby, a moisture farmer nearby, a few days ago. Yesterday they stole this month's supply for the bar, and now I won't be able to pay the royalists' water taxes. Well, we can't have scrappers bothering the locals, and they should be rather flush to boot. Keep whatever else you round up, just bring my supplies back to me. I figure you, I figure you owe me, Faraday. Okay, I did not expect an actual lyric song here. Okay, and we can recruit people if we have enough stars. Uh, of, of course there's... Of course there's gambling. How about some new riggings? Uh, not gambling this, uh, in this case, then. Carrion pistol, small repair box... A repair box brass knuckles. A burn brawler's first choice when cornered leaves a plus one melee mark on your enemy's <laughs> your opponent's chin. That could be useful. We actually have 1200 water. A small storage unit. Increase your inventory by one, allowing you to store one extra spade. Yeah, one extra item. A bare necessity and fundamental investment for any item collector. Okay, that's the same as what we got. 
plus health, two health on a character, use one, per, one use per mission. Wait, does that mean that this thing is reusable? That might be really useful. So let's get that. And that. I will stay the room for the box as well if you can afford it. I'm going to save up the water we have. We might need it for something else. Okay. So, Captain, how is old Gat getting by? Well, we're not alone in having problems with these dang scrappers. Yeah, where do they even come from? They are making us... us they are making all of us... Uh, all the piratey types look bad. Where did they come from? Where did they go? Where did they come from? Scrapper died, Joe. Oh, uh, uh, you ask for this. I, you, okay, you what? You ask for this, Captain. The gun, you foul <laughs> demon, <laughs> cotton I yo. Thy grasp on this <laughs> realm fade long ago. For whence you came, therefore you shall go. I sail you away, cotton I yo. <laughs> I still have that note, yes. Uh, let's see. Marco, he's got more of a sailor like voice. I think passives work with all crewmates? Yeah, I can't. <clears throat> the Royal Space Force will surely need to get involved if the scrappers spread much more. There won't be a safe harbor left for us in the outskirts if it comes to that. Then let's go help get out and pay the scrappers back while we're at it. Let's, let's go beat some scrappers and school this troublemaker that's been bothering Gats. Okay. Does this hmm. the crew have anything to say? Nope. Oh, nope. Triple Threat Terrors. This ship belongs to a trio of terrible chopper class scrappers that have been attacking moisture farmers lately. The crew should stop them from kidnapping the locals. I, I'm fully expecting at least one Star Wars reference to come with these moisture farmers. Okay. Oh, kill the triplets. Okay. Hmm. Oh, okay. It's a set of damage of two on this one. Okay, it's the two shows the plus uh, damage on the maximum. The critical. Now, uh, any weapon is going to be better than the basic. Okay, let's give you that, and give you that. Okay. Because, yeah, we're going to be up, getting up close and personal with Gabriel a lot more than we're likely to get with Captain. Oh, blood. Look at her face. <laughs> That's a permanent frown. Do you have to see what I'm talking about earlier? She kind of looked like she was inspired by the Iron Man. <laughs> Maybe, yeah. Uh... Okay, let's get started. <clears throat> let's see. Hyper starter weapon after the laser sights, like all sharpshooter class weapons. Okay. Let me actually. Oh, okay. We don't have a laser sight on this one. Okay, I should have taken note of that. Uh oh. Okay. One. In this world, there's two kinds of people, my friends. Those with loaded guns and those who dig. You dig? Okay. Okay. Oh, no way we're missing that. And it does look like we have... We're not getting some tutorials or something, because I'm pretty sure we... You got a tutorial on bouncing shots. I wonder what that's a reference to. Uh, it's a reference. I just forgot from where or which one is the original. Take them out. Uh, we're not taking shelter behind the explosive. Yeah, please don't. Okay. Payback. The payback ability is activated when an enemy attempts damage you. Next attack will do massive damage. Okay. 
There we go. Okay. Now let's check over here. Um, okay, that was a little bit of a risk, but with so small of a room, I wasn't really expecting to have anyone pop up from there. Okay, now do these doors lead into the same space or not? They do not. Tuco, hey. when you have to shoot, shoot. Don't talk. Okay. Thank you. Just the, the room is under. But they have a hat just under them, it seems. Yeah. This shot. Okay. Should have expected there to be at least one. Okay. Take this one out. You. Uh, take cover here. Oh, I actually got this. I got them as well. <laughs> okay. Oh, <laughs> nice shot. Okay, and that's all of them dealt with. Okay, that leaves only up here. I probably should hold back a bit so we can repair uh, sea brass. Guards. Okay, what was that noise? There must, was, there must have been something. Oh wait, that's the that was the ability cooldown. Okay. For a second, get over here. Oh, that we can't use that on. Okay, we can't use it on another. It has to be used on ourselves. There we go. We have the loot. That can be concerning. <clears throat> there. Okay, that just means we'll probably have to equip it. Uh, we'll have to meet, move the health button, the, yeah, the med kit to see brass. Angel optics. You filthy baggers have been, uh, have, have, yeah, have been protecting angels. Uh, what? You, you better have protect the angels. Yeah. <laughs> you jumped over one word. Yep, that went nowhere. Mm. God damn it, I... Okay. Actually, you... Since you're already pissed off anyways... There we go. It's a good thing those bounce shots can't uh, hit friendlies, it seems. Though there might be some weapons where they do hit friendlies. Most of the explosives. Yeah. There. Okay, that should be everything. Yep, 100%. And it's Marco's taking a break. Okay. Oop, another one of these. Carry an Uzi. <coughs> a high-speed bullet dispenser with a quick release. <coughs> Don't be dismayed by the aim. Those bullets will spread just fine. Water. And... Okay, another one of these. Nice. Now we can okay. give me that. Yep. See rice. Again, I know Seabrass is a bad. Uh, it's supposed to be a pun, but once it's a pun, that actually turned into a badass name. Let's see. He's called Seabrass because his knuckles and his nuts are both um, <laughs> are both made of brass. Yeah, and but also a pun on sea bass. Yeah. Those triplets won't be bothering any farmer for a while. We should go teach the strapper that took Gat's triplet the same lesson. Okay. 
We can't let these scrappers take over any more of our turf. I don't like it, Wonky. Much like hull rust, ma'am. They'll spread uncontrollably if not handled promptly. Sea brass has nothing new to say. It's a big-looking ship, ma'am. It might be best to enlist more crew before taking it on. I do believe I ran past a fierce young lady back at Gat's bar. Yeah, I was about to <laughs> turn back on my own for this. But yeah, good that the game reminds you to. Okay. Sally. Looks like you're no stranger to hard work. I know how to handle myself around Fuzz. You won't find a meaner varmint killer anywhere in the outskirts. That's great. We could really use someone of your skills. I won't lend my gun to just anyone. You need more than gallons it can buy. You need a reputation. I've seen enough snake oil salesmen back at the farm, and Pa didn't raise no pool. Let's see. Once they lost the moisture farm, Sally's siblings spread out throughout the scout outskirts, leaving her to fend for herself. This farm girl is both stubborn and trigger happy, and she's a bounty hunter. Ooh wee! <laughs> I'll be shooting fiends and heisting treasure just like back at the farm. Wait, what? <laughs> what sort of farm did you run? Oh dear. Right, I've my dreams. Okay. Let's see, what do you have to say? So, when am I gonna get to shoot some scrappers? Easy there, Miss Bolt. Just let me at him, boss. She is very eager. Oh, she wouldn't be a bounty hunter if she wasn't eager for the job. Let's see, Gats wears. A chopper class scrapper going by the name Edna Jane has made it off with all of Gat's wares for the month. Find this crate and escape. I can destroy the generator, get Gat's wares, and evacuate. Okay. Let's see, how much does this do? A static of four. Oh, wait, no. Mm, let's give him the Uzi. Also, let's give him all the new kits. Crocker cap. A mesh netted hats, foam fronts, and rigged uh, backing, certain to keep even the warmest chipper chill on a hot day. And let's see, what is your basic gun? Junkyard revolver, three damage and plus one critical. Your default hog leg, bland, but it'll keep you company. Used if no other, yeah. Okay, let's give it this. And yeah, we don't really have anything else to give. And let's get started. Let's see. Left trigger to change characters. Wait, did someone... Did someone get stuck in the airlock as it closed? Okay. That fortified door, uh, yeah, that fortified door is locked up pretty tight. I'm sure they keep their stolen goods in there. Gets wares included. The security system is powered by a generator. Wreck it and then return to grab whatever's inside. Okay. Let's see. Sea brass goes up front. And then Sally is taking up the back here. I'm curious what sort of range she will be best at. Like, the captain is going to be good at the range since he's a sharpshooter. We just have to find a, well, a sharpshooter weapon for her. Okay, immediately contact, immediately loot. And... Okay, upward spread. Okay. Okay, for a moment it looked like she was aiming for something across the hall or something. There. Okay, Piper. That's nothing else here. And yeah. It does look like there is some random generation with the ships. Especially since, well, <laughs> the game said generating ship earlier. Uh, let's see. Sea brass over there. Sally, get behind. 
I'm going to guess that this is going to open up into two different rooms. Let's just stack up on the same door. See brass? Okay, two different rooms, like I thought. But, oh, we've got a new one. Yeah, I think it is a good idea to spread out so you can uh, have a more ground. There you go. <laughs> this junk that just keeps spreading around. Um. Okay, no good shots to take. No good cover places to go for either, so guards holding my horses. Really? Okay, these are melee only. Okay, just put one in the back of their heads. Okay, and when you when you get in melee range, your weapon gets disabled. Let's see. Total damage six. Three from melee, plus two from payback, and plus one from brass knuckles. Okay. Uh, I guess you could call that a left hook, because he used his left hand, which is a hook. Uh, that, that, that actually will be brutal. Need to grab that. Okay. Hmm. Okay, let's gather up at these doors. These are far too close to each other to be different rooms. Yeah, do I do suspect that you do need to look uh, at the other rooms for trash doors? Yeah. Mm. Off the pot, what's that even supposed to mean? What? Uh, something Sally said. Okay. Um, it was. Uh, yeah, there's Edna Jane. What have we here? A pesky little cowbot sneaking around our ship. You tell him, cuz. You don't stand a chance. This is scrapper turf now. We'll trash you and take your pieces back to mother. Once Moss, uh, once Moss true with her plan, not even the Royal Space Force will rival us. Uh, yeah, will rival our scrappers. And our scrappers will have all the gallons. <laughs> right, just one more thing. If you have the same mother, how uh, can you all be cousins? Shut up. <laughs> uh, their bodies aren't the only thing made of scrap. Okay. Uh, Okay, if we go here... Uh, let's see if we can bounce a shot. Yep, there we go. Can't move. Okay. Wait, does, does shooting them in the legs <laughs> cripple them, or is that just a bounty hunter thing? Good question. There we go. Okay. No real need to stick to cover. There we go. Nope. Oh, uh, what did you do? Is that the alarm? Hmm, it seems like it's just a minor one, indicated by the lone skull symbol. Nevertheless, those scrappers will keep coming, so get Gat's wares and leave without further delay. Okay. Okay, so not self destruct. Yeah, I, I was. I, that was what I was fearing for a second. Okay, uh, you run over here. Yeah, you run over there. You. Yep. <laughs> Terrible shot. Okay. No, wait, no. I. <laughs> I failed to see that, I, that he ran too far with that one. My bad on that. There we go. 
Okay. Uh, okay, I see the skulls in the upper right. I'm guessing that's sort of the alarm level or something. Yeah. Uh, again, I'll be sure definitely see if we can grab some more loot, but there should probably more loot around than your spam. Yeah. Like up there, perhaps. Yeah, with that, I think I'll just going to peek into the room with someone after we get uh, after we get to after we get Gat's wares. If there is any loot in there, we'll stick around for it. If not, oh hello, they're moving out now. Okay. Okay, that may mean that uh, that might be loot in there. But I usually draw the loot room. Okay. I'm guessing that also means that they're, yeah, they are aware that we're here now. It's just that, yep, and they will actually, some of them will actually go looking. I want to, yep, yes, yeah, we want to be careful with these, yep, with these spawn spots of theirs. Okay. We kind of want to be close enough that we can intercept any that spawn, but not too close that they can immediately get a shot off or something. There's some swag and a hat. Okay, pull back. Um, uh, can we even... Sally taking a hit. Okay, luckily all of them are just melee. Okay, you... Okay, so if, if one dies, they don't body block the rest of the shots. There we go. There goes cover. And... There go day. Okay, Sally, get up here quick before something spawns out of that. Okay. You... Go over here, actually. The other two can go collect... Uh, I'm guessing they are spawning from the ones further away from us or something. Okay, you grab this. Uh, Sally, grab that. Okay. Uh, okay, he has a gun, so that's going to be a problem. Let's see, I suspect he'll be able to get behind this barrel here. So if we stay here with Seabrass, also let's heal up. Yeah, he'll be able to shoot at Sally though. Yep. And completely miss. <laughs> That's what we came for. Now get out of there before any more scrap is decided to join the party. Okay, do we specifically need this one? Uh, yeah, we need specifically to go to that one. Okay. I had a thought that maybe we could get into separate ones or something, but no. Yeah, let's uh, get the heck out of here. And yeah, we can just bolt for it. We've got enough distance. Or, as you could say, full steam ahead. We're gonna have to jump them. Yes. Oop. 
You stared at each other. Yeah, a scrapper love story. Um, and out. I think what's best that they were. Where are they, Billy? Hmm? Bronze teapot. A delightful curiosity, rumored to have been worshipped at least three times a day following tender procedures, bound to bring a sweet payoff when sold. <laughs> okay. And... Scoped short rounds. A concealed carry with improved sighting radius heightens both the close and long range game. Going to the captain. Okay. No casualties. Full stars. Okay. I do have to say that is a pretty sight in the background with just an atmosphere with uh, yeah, chunks of planets. Cargo secured, ma'am. Back to Gats. Yes, we'll drop off his wares and ask around about you know, this bo mother boss. Clearly, she's controlling these cravings. If the Scrapper Gang keeps growing, we might just have a war on our hands once the dang royalists show up. Yeah, Livy is hard enough without them gallon hoarded royalists rattling about. Around. You have to admit, it feels kind of nice to help Gat for once, ma'am. I've been a screw on his side long enough. Nice to be the good bot nuts for once. It's good to have this solar wind at our back. <laughs> the bad we have to beat around these scrappers instead of doing a long run. Come on, being locked up like a chicken bot in a coop ain't nothing for us. Beating scrappers is uh, what yeah, is what it's all about. <laughs> if only we'd have a bit of peace and quiet aboard. <laughs> okay, these two are not going to get along. <laughs> Have you settled in all right here? Yeah, yeah, all right there, Miss Bolt. I know how to take care of myself, but I ain't dumb, you know. Just making sure you're comfortable. We farmers know all about everything when it comes to survival. And of course, <laughs> of course, this first uh, place you went to was the... Okay, that's not a bar, is it? There's oil. There's space dig, small molds. Okay. So you went straight to what counts as a sort of library around here? Hmm. Let's get these crates back to Gaz and ask around about his scrapper boss. Okay. So you're back. I wasn't sure I could trust you, but you're not as bad as you let shine on, Paraday. And here I thought myself a short swagger had you fooled. I know we've not always seen eye to eye, you and me, uh, Piper, but we really need to stop these crappers. You're right about that. I just need to find our boss and teach her some manners, is all. You should talk to Taps Wire at Lola's bar. She hears things and might point you might point you to the scrapper boss. That's in the colony. The miners there aren't rightly welcoming to bots in my line of work. They're just not uh, so fond of pirates. Keep fighting trappers and I bet they'll let you in. Okay. And it looks like these wares are always going to be the same. Yeah, I would say buy storage thingy. As you can afford. That. It's true. Uh, what have we to do with you, Captain? Let's see. Captain Piper Faraday, smuggler Captain Piper Faraday and her trusty pilot Wonky hide out in the outskirts, far away from any royal jail. Brings out the best in her crewmates. Uh, Gabriel Seabrass Stubb. This dour whaler bot lost everything he held dear when the royalists monopolized the whale oil industry. He's good at hitting, heading up the fan guards. And Sally Bolt. Once they lost the moisture farm, uh, we've read it already. Okay, they all have six movements. Sally has the least amount of health. Uh, she and Piper share the same amount of damage. And yeah, 
Gabriel just has the most, both in gunplay and uh, melee. Hmm. Okay, we can just sell it from here. And yeah, it looks like it would be a good idea to get some more storage space. But Let's head can... for the colony. Hmm? Yeah, we can go back. Yeah, you can do hmm. that and do uh, get it from there right away. Let's head for the colony, see if we can get through to, and talk to this taps person. Hmm. I wonder if I can swap stuff around <clears throat> when at the ship. Or equipment around this. Okay. One of these for now. Hmm. Okay. What have we here? Challenge mission. When the going gets tough. Looks like this could be too much to chew for a fresh crew. Maybe uh, when you've gained some experience. Okay. I think he runs downwards. Smoking Barrel. This charismatic gentlebot running the Smoking Barrel franchise is always pleased to charm and arm cautious cowbots with rifles, pistols, and automatics. Okay, another shop. Also, I just noticed Wonky has a plant. Ernest. Okay. <laughs> okay. Small gear codburn. Pardon me for saying so, but you look like someone who'd appreciate some trusty gear, ma'am. It's carrion pistol frontier surety. Flat five damage. But that, that probably means five bullets with the shotguns. Oh yeah, scatter fire five, it says at the bottom. So yeah, five rounds of one damage each. Don't let the short range fool you. With, uh, to the fi with the five projectile spread, it uh, bites kind of nice. And we have a blacksmith sniper. What you gain in aim comes at the co price of movement. Shoot or move, your call. Okay, can't shoot after moving. Okay. And the frontier SMG. Okay. Burst fire of four, but damage of five. So one of those must deal two damage, while the rest do one. Oh, at the back here, freaking grenade launcher, big bang. It's safe to say that the world wouldn't be the same without it. Relatively speaking, it's, it expands on you. And it has it has friendly fire. Okay, yeah. so okay, that's good. It warms us. Blacksmith Derringer. Pretty much an amped up parlor gun, easily concealed and fires two rounds. The total damage is the sum of both attacks. Okay, we need a certain amount of reputation to get them to be able to buy these at all. Strap grenades, uh, adds action, shoots, uh, shoot a grenade with an arc trajectory, up to six damage inside an area on impacts, one use. But it's a utility, rusty heavy armor. Increases health by one, decreases sprint distance by one, additionally tempered armor plating. Okay. I'm going to leave that for now. Hmm. I'm somewhat tempted to get this one. Yep. Then I buy it an accident. <laughs> okay, well, we've got a good amount of uh, yeah, we've got a good amount of gallons. Okay. Watering Heights. A large ship with lots of ladders. Relieve it of swag and thin out the scrapper herd while at it. The mining bots in the colony are bound to appreciate it. Take care, the escape pod may be far off once the objective is reached. Okay, so this is a looter run. Let's see. Hmm. Oh yeah, you definitely need to upgrade your storage. Yeah. Three to four plus one. Oh, uh, actually, maybe you need to do it right away. Uh, uh, okay, now I see it. <clears throat> uh, well, I'm pretty sure if we run, if we get full, we can just sell off some stuff like these basic pistols. 
Uh, I was wrong with the with the number that's shown on the right with the stats. The, on the right is what you is what you currently have equipped has. Hmm. Let's actually take that one. And you you can't use that. Okay. Wrong weapon class. Sharpshooter tier one. Okay. To hmm. Sally is not the sniper. Yeah, she's a bounty hunter. I do wonder what that means for the types of guns she can take. Though I guess it could have looked. I might have been able to get a sneak peek of that at the gun store. Hmm. Okay. Any utilities? No. Okay. Let's get started then. Yeah, we. If I can find some armor that increases his uh, damage resistance, then I'll definitely uh, put Seagrass up close a lot more. Uh, dang it, you've triggered an alarm countdown. When it reaches zero, a, one, a level one alarm will go off. Okay. Get into cover. Sea brass. Get over here. And there. <laughs> okay, all four of them. And hello in chat, runners for life. How are you doing today? Okay. Welcome. Now, we're going to have to rush with this. Not a good, not a good level to have a, a shoot or move your weapon on. Uh, oh, hello. Uh, we are not hiding behind that. Okay. Uh, yep. <laughs> okay, that was a bit of a. That was a Hail Mary of a shot, I have to say. And it looks like there's going to be all sorts of small side rooms. Or actually, no, I'm guessing this is going to be one high one or something. You can check like this. Yeah, I thought so. Uh, that's going to be blocked by the barrel, so pull back. Uh, I don't know how big the blast radius on these barrels is. So I don't know if Sally is in the blast radius. Um, you get all the way down there. Uh, let's see. Runners. Good, I changed my thing to runners for life, but it's really one stir or whatever. Okay. Okay, that probably should have hit him in his own knee or something. It would have been funny if that did happen. Here we go. Uh, do you see what just happened? That he just fell apart? Uh, more of you shot ricocheted to the point behind you, the ricocheted back and hit him. <laughs> okay. Um... I'm not seeing any swag yet, so it's probably all in one room or something. Okay, I thought I still had sea brass moving. Okay. Brass, get up here. Or down here. Sally, go around. Yeah, I don't think we want that gun that can only be shoot or moved. We want to... Uh, yeah, we want flexible weapons. Sniper weapons have the best range and increased in a critical chance, however you can't shoot after moving. Okay, so that's what they mean with most range, as in it'll bounce the most. Holy. Okay, can maybe I hit that, that gun is good off roll then. It's not yeah, they, there is a moment that it hits the barrel. I 
<laughs> okay. Okay, so we can shoot and then move. Okay. Alright. Sally, over here, please. See how much. Okay, there isn't much room left. Okay. Oh, there's some loot. Okay. Uh, what, are, what are you doing with all the raid symbols and such, runners? Did you come along with the raid earlier? Oh, more loot. Okay, there's two more. I have... You know, that's, that's unlocked. That's a locked door. We need to break something to get that open, I think. Okay, alarm is about to go off. Sally? Hello there. Can I get a shot off on the other guy there? Oh. Yes! On the battle roll! <laughs> okay, I, I think I'm going to love these uh, sniper weapons. Yeah, okay, I was a, a bit skeptical about that you can't, you can't move and shoot with them. But seeing that... Yeah, it, it makes it worth it. And yeah, that also confirmed. Yeah, that also confirmed uh -oh. that there is no friendly fire with all normal weapons. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm going to love these things. <laughs> Okay, one more piece of swag, and okay, that has to be behind that door then. <laughs> okay, that, that's just going to be such utter bullshit with being able to bounce a bullet halfway through a ship and still kill someone. Uh, bullshit, oh, good bullshit, I'll say, but still. Uh, Sally. Is Not that kind. Oh, I was expecting we'd have to run all the way back up. But they didn't warn you that you may have to do that. Uh, they warned that the the exit might be far from where we end up or something. Yeah, might be. Yeah. I wonder if there is, there is a way to tell which of the. Uh, which of the escape pods will be available? Or which of the escape pods will be the one for you for you escape? You, you should just move her down. Yeah. You so we can too so much fun with it. Yeah, we could consider that an elaborate warning shot. Though maybe maybe we don't need that much of a warning shot if they're such a terrible shot. Okay, that one might actually get a shot in, or or not. Bye-bye, bozos. Okay, that was actually pretty fun. <laughs> Repair oil. That's a free Rare. action. Restore plus two health once per mission. Okay, so basically... Uh, yeah, basically a free version of uh, the med kit. Yeah, it's a free action, even. Uh, 
<laughs> oh, good thing we got that now, eh? And more water. Is he gonna buy some, Captain? Yeah. Go! Let's see, kill shots. When bounty hunters deliver a fatal shot to an enemy, they gain one additional shot. Only works once per turn and only when using regular attacks. That could be really useful. Also, let's see. Uh, this character can use assault class weapons. Consist of shotguns and submachine guns. Very effective in close range combat and can damage multiple targets. Okay. Wait, submachine gun? She should have the UC. I don't think it mean it means more that they can wield them, not that they get bonuses to it, or at least not yet. Well, let's see if rumor of her daring deeds have spread into colony. Those dirty rock shovelers are so smug behind iron builds of asteroids. Uh, the locals are sure down on their luck with all these scrappers harassing them. Handling as many as possible is a good thing. However, did they grow so fast? Who would volunteer to join these crazies? I don't think it's a voluntary thing. I think everyone who gets scrapped gets, well, turned into a scrapper. Dirty mining bots. They've been keeping us out of their colony for years. To be fair, we're not the most trustworthy, on account of the smuggling and occasional stealing and such. Of course, we bought some gallows here and there. <laughs> At gunpoint, I think it doesn't count as borrowing them. The colony seems like a decent enough place. Once we're done with this scrapper business, I might uh, use my share to buy a plot of colony rock. <laughs> I hate to admit it, but even you're too good for the likes of M Rock Pickers. Okay. I, I, am I even sound like a pirate in the movie? Sound, what do I sound like at the moment? Uh, no comment. <clears throat> Let's see. Mining colony. This mi mineral rich belt of space debris is well protected. To talk to Taps Wire, the crew has to gather enough reputation to get through. Simple pirates are not welcome. And well, we have enough reputation for that. And also, there's something here Astro Lawn. Really? <laughs> Astro Turf, but Lawn? A well kept lawn on an inexplicably difficult to pass space rock. The old cowbot caring for it looks armed and grumpy. Best to keep off the grass. <laughs> well, it's not like they're throwing a parade, but we're on the same side after all. Okay. Lola's. Lola's been a staple for the colony for nearly 400 years. The current proprietor, Taps Wire, serves both information and beverages to the inhabitants. The place looks quieter than it should. Okay, so it's been at least four centuries since the, uh, since the big boom. Probably more even than that. Holy. Blacksmith revolver. Potent hand with, with a sturdy design. Just feeling its weight in your hand makes you feel uh, more composed. Front, uh, okay, shoddy mark two. Speed boots. Functional shoes for fall to winter. Essentials in any heister's wardrobe. Increased movement distance by one. Would be good for vanguards. But at the moment, let's keep what? it as Wait. is. Say that again? For vanguards. There you go. And Ivansky. You said Vanguard. Uh, oh, uh. <laughs> Welcome, stranger. Not a lot of bots crazy enough to dare venture out in times like these. And here I always thought that the colony was the safest place in the whole outskirts. <laughs> It was, but once the scrappers broke through, it's hard times all around. Making it worse, royalist divers are claiming asteroids, drilling for oil. Rumor is the jerks needed for some perilous missions into deep space. You seem to know quite a lot. Get Parrot said you might even know who's leading the scrapper gang. Well, usually I would, but many of my sources are too afraid to go out. 
I bet they'd serve us again if it wasn't for a certain brutal crusher terrorizing the colony. I might be able to help with that. Bring these cowering cowbots out of hiding. Also, look at the signboard. <laughs> Wait, it. That's Lola from the Steamroll Dig One. <laughs> yeah, now you recognize her. Uh, the yeah. name and all that. Let's see, the spine. It's hard to get this tour flying with all these scrappers running around. They don't scare us, though. I mean, come on, they look like patched up shreds, shreds of junk. And Valentine. You didn't really sport the look of a hired gun, now do you? Don't let appearances fool you, Captain. There's a lot more to this adventure than meets the eye. On the outlook for an engineer with marksman skills? That's a sniper gun, alright. And we need to run a little more crew. I'm ready for adventures filled with gallons and treasure. Now for that sign up and on bonus pay. Let's see. Valentine Butterbolt. Valentine had a secure life as a chimney engineer. Now retired, he's looking for high adventure. Don't let his shake his, yeah, don't let his shaking fool you. If he's stationary, he's steady. And he's a sentry. Okay. Hmm. We've got plenty of water for this. Swashbuckling adventure, here I come. Golden days are golden days. Okay, we need one more reputation before we can get uh, Ivansky here. And, well, he certainly looks like we want him, huh? Yeah. He, he reminds me of Red Ivan from Evil Genius. Why is he lifting weights? Because why not? Hmm. Captain? What? Orange? Let's see. Inventory, items. We've got a bit we can use. No. Is it? Okay, the only difference is that it's a free action. Hmm. We're gonna need more now since we've got the other oh, no, crewmates. Yeah, I think. Yeah, I think we buy this the next time we buy more inventory. Oh, 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 they don't bring their equipment. We we, <laughs> we have to supply them. Yes, exactly. That, and here's the problem. It still counts as those items are still in the inventory, even if you've kept them on them. I know. Let's see. Let's rid the colony of scrappers and stop this brutal crusher, man. We do. <clears throat> Okay, we do one more mission, then no matter how well, as long as we get one star, we can get someone new as well. Fully loaded. Screams for help seem to be emanating from this suspicious looking scrapper space truck. It's fully loaded, and with all the farmers gone missing lately, it might be worth checking out. Also, I'm noticing that okay, I think we have limits. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> okay, I missed I mistook the stars earlier for spaces, or space for crew to bring along. We can only bring two with this, I think. So rescue the farmer and evacuate. Yeah, I think the story is for how yeah. well you've done it. Okay, you get a shotgun. Hmm. I wonder if we can redo missions. Also, just if can, to have a bit of space. If we can, awesome. Because it would be a good way to uh, yeah, earn experience. cash <clears throat> as well. Because we could do off screen. If it is possible. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'd like that it actually retreats and all that. And yeah, that is definitely a sight, huh? Yeah. Okay, some some chunks are still sticking to the core. Okay, those are probably going to be other hellscapes, being that close. Okay. Take up positions. There we go. 
perfect line of sight. Yep. Hello there. No, not move. That big box blocking the route and block, yeah, blocking the way. Okay. Piper, hey, you stick like there for a second. You forgot to talk to your new crewmate. Uh, yeah, we can do that in a second. Well, after this. Too late. Mm -hmm. Gonna stay shame on you. Or I'll punish you. Let's see. How much? Hmm. Let's get down here. Let's see. Okay, I think those have five health, seeing as there were five red ones popping out of that one. Mm. Nothing this way. Let's put you here. There. Oh, hello. Let's see if we have Okay, so yeah, shooting them in the leg does prevent them from moving. Okay, and we are not taking cover behind an explosive barrel. There we go. Oh yeah, people, ne never take cover behind explosive barrels in games or in real life. Yeah. Okay, let's see, this has to be a little small room. Okay. You Actually, I'm not a good uh, helpful tip. Never use anyone armed with a flamethrower, especially the ones with a backpack, as a meat shield. Yeah, since those can well go boom. Yeah. Hello and goodbye. I can. Okay, I can open that. And. Can I bounce a shot around to them? No. Oh, oh, actually, yes. One button. <laughs> okay, I'm just loving these trick shots. Yeah, I thought first it would be more. I was more annoying with not being able to move around and shoot, but the range and tricks so compensate uh, for you not being. Actually, if you were to do all those long trick shots and move, it would be extremely OP. Yeah. Hey, fellas, it's me, Mosby the Moisture Farmer. Very much glad to see you. A gang of nasty triplets nabbed me from my farm and threw me in this scrap heap for transport. Been hanging here for so long I can't feel my legs no more. It'd be mighty decent if you could send me back to my farm. You can just pick him up like an item. Oh, uh, hello. Peggy Dawn. How did these cowbots get on board, cousin? Don't know. Let's show them how, let's show them where you end up if you board a scrapper ship. With our current hall, I don't know if we can even fit them in there. We can make a little more room in the hole. Just take them right, uh, then take them right to the junkyard. Okay, so we're going to have to fight our way past these. Uh, do you pay attention to the names? Uh, one of them was Peggy Don, and what? What was the other one? Fleetest. Of course. The most some of the most hillbilly names you can find. Yeah, I don't think it's actually originally a Roman name. I'm just unsure how it became a stereotypical redneck name. Hmm. 
Okay, with B, I can get out of the actions menu. Let's see. Let's take up a spot over here. That should give a good line of fire. Oh, especially if the dumbasses are going to hide behind a bar <laughs> explosive barrel. Okay, this isn't even a trick shot anymore. Is there a way that I can... Yes, I think yes. I can have the both of them. I can... <laughs> okay, that was the best accidental buy I think I've had in a game ever. Uh, yeah, but you just kill Cletus. Uh, let's see, runners. I wonder what would happen if you stood on the explosives. Would it blow up and make you fly? Uh, we, you can't, you can't stand on the same spot as there is a bit of cover. As you can see, if I push left, it goes straight to the other side of it. Same here. No, there. This isn't even a trick shot. A crit in the face. Okay. Lost room. Okay. okay, two melees, but nothing of value really. Rush okay. over there. Let's see, wow, this game is stupid for that. So I think it makes up more <laughs> on just all the other bullshit we can do with these trick shots. Speaking of... There is a line there where it will bounce off... The, uh, damn it. Where it'll, it would have bounced off the explosive barrel into the next one. Uh, okay, these what they are really scrapped for brains, huh? Just shoot that up his tailpipe. I really suspect that that's how they actually recruit more. As if all the colonies are the Marauder and Customs. Yeah. The Marauder is King all the bots, they use the parts to make more. Yep. From we did learn yard. how to, uh, yeah, we did learn how new bots are quote unquote born in this world. By, well, being made from other parts. Hmm. Yeah, the parent will make them, and they will have some part of the parent in them. Oop. Scrap grenade, nice. And a harpoon gun, rare, sharpshooter, brings the wisdom of woe to those foolish enough to resemble big white marine mammals. Keep away from angry sea dogs. <laughs> no ricochets, but it does have a laser sight. Ooh. Another purple. The Caesar, a night shooter developed during the Cannibal Wars, chambered for a multi caliber maim of any aggressor. Also a sharpshooter. 100% cripple and long laser sights. And uh, the farmer, a bag with half broken moisture farmer stamped with postage and ready for shipping back to the farm. It seems your inventory is full, but I sell some gear to make room for new. Yeah, we can sell these basic pistols. Okay, and that's all the spot. That's all the space we have. Okay, we have more than <laughs> more sharpshooter weapons that we know what to do with. Yeah, now maybe start investing in more inventory space, Captain. Yes, yes. Oh no, I'm not done with being snarky yet. Just don't know, don't know how to be communicate snarky to uh, make you laugh or be feel pain. Let's see. Inspire. Piper inspires allies next to her, which makes them deal plus one bonus damage. As long as at least one ally is inspired, Piper is also inspired. Okay, that can be real oh, useful. Right. The problem might be with 
if she's equipped with a sniper weapon, uh, she, you know, she'll need someone else with long-range weaponry next to her to do that. And another plus one. Or, no, this is the actual plus one health. Uh, the first plus one health for him. All right. Or almost be got a rough deal. Yar! Why am I going with that accent? Yes, I do wonder how he's supposed to tend the crops now without a leg to stand on. He's a farmer, he can take it. Mighty good of us to send him back home though. Okay. More to chat. So that was Lola's? Can't say I'm impressed by the your my bad on that. So what was it, Lolas? Can't say I'm impressed by its wiener. Veneer. Yarr. Veneer. Oh, ven okay. Now, now, no need to ride the high steam horse. We'll help out this. Cr uh, with, we'll help out with this crusher and get help in return. Right? I'm just saying that we are. Uh, we have heard so much about the color. This is know it all, bartender. Well, yeah, the stuff does tend to get stuff does get uh, tend to get uh, exaggerated. I'm sorry for dragging you into these fights, Wonky. We've been through tough times before, man. Yes, yes, but I'm getting pretty thoroughly tired of uh, thoroughly tired of withering them. I'm sick of being on the run. We haven't been in a lawful enterprise for a long time now, man. Let's see, I'm guessing they might be... There they are. You sure you're up for some high space adventure, Mr. Butter uh, Butterbolt? I almost said Butterbot. Royal Captain, the retirement home wasn't, it just wasn't for me, I guess. Stamp collecting is the most boring hobby, uh, uh, more, uh, boring hobby imaginable. Too much like work. <laughs> I really do prefer firing guns at the gun range. It's nice to have a useful hobby. In this world, that is a useful hobby, I guess. Yeah. Okay, now let's get yet another crewmate. And we have enough water for an inventory upgrade. Arr. You look like you're prepared for anything. We're hiring if you're interested. Ivanski is strong, bot, but important is why you are fighting. Battle must have good purpose. Well, we are finding the scrappers from spreading out more than they already have. To help weaker bots, Ivanski will fight. But if undertaking only for betterment of self, Ivanski can just pump iron instead. And he is another vanguard. Okay. Circus strongmen need to project uh, project strength. So once rumors about the great Ivanski's soft spot spread, harsh words made him leave the big time. Knows how to take a punch. Okay. Ha, wonderful. We will have great adventures. And he runs off. I do like that they just run they that they actually run to your ship instead of just poofing out of existence. It, oh, these yeah. are eight hundreds. Okay, does the... Oh, okay, I'm guessing the price goes up with each one that we buy. Let's test yeah. it out. Or not. Okay. Well, Maybe. next time we go back to the other place and buy it from there and see if it's cheaper. We'll have to see, yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, we just got scammed. It's a fine thing to have some strong clamps on the, on the ship. Captain, you want to workshop time? Ivanski will spot you later. Build up pressure, make hydraulics strong, yes? Good for crushing large scrappers. Yeah, that's certainly not a small gun that he has there. I still aren't sure... How will that help? But... If I actually have organic mushrooms, I will understand, but... He's... Should I really even need to exercise? 
uh, also I missed this one earlier. Runners for life, if they go to explosive, then their brains are out of clean oil. Yeah. Hmm. Can we actually go back to these? Yes, we can. Okay, so that is a way that you can level up your crew a bit more, I think. Let's see. Explosives transports. The ship is filled to the brim with stolen explosive. Uh, explosives. It's more or less a flying bomb. Can't have that floating about the colony. Handle the crazy scrapper crew and get out. Okay, kill all the scrappers and evacuate. Might be time to swap out to some other folk. Hmm. Let's... Oh, hello. Okay, he's a sharpshooter. You, heavy, and handgun. Can use heavy weapons, launchers, and other bigger guns. They do splash damage that can hit multiple foes. Okay, we don't have any of those. Let's... Actually, I think the... Yeah, I think the captain is required. Or maybe... Let's see. Can we swap you out? Yes, we can. Okay. That, we've learned that now, then. Okay. Sally, you get these. You get something with the sharpshooter. percent cripple does that mean that they cripple on every hit or something or is it only hmm wait it might be 100 percent guarantee cripple if you shoot for the legs now both of the shots that we've landed on the legs so far have crippled but we'll have to see now let's give him that and give him hmm. actually you take the grenades Okay. Okay, I like that the captain isn't required. So at least kill shot gives you a free shot. Yeah. I almost forgot about that, actually. Yep, Sally. Okay. They both went to cover by high explosive barrel. Oh, for lava. Okay. One target. Valentine. Uh, hmm. I think the I think the explosives only damage directly next to them. Don't know if that might destroy the loot though. I need a, I need a line that goes for the barrel. Out there. Of course I miss. <laughs> okay. Um, this is a risk. Uh, if we can just blow up the barrel, yeah, there. Actually, okay, I, that, I think I got lucky there. I might have, that might have, those shots might have bounced back into the barrels that Sally was behind. Yeah, it looked like that, didn't it? Okay, grab that. Okay, you stay there. Get behind. Runners, adults, are you ready, kids, for trading? Don't worry, just go to the explosives, kids. Okay. Oh, 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 three of them. Okay. Let's see. There we go. Okay, and with Sally... Mm. Uh, 
I honestly do not want to be near these barrels. So let's actually move up and out of the way of them. Yeah, might as well yeah, grab let's... that. <laughs> he actually ricocheted the shot into Valentine. Yeah. I don't want to have one health, but he did kill his own friend as well. There we go, repair oil. It was kind of a fail, wasn't it? Yeah. Well, you fail on the enemy's uh, part. That was a real small window there, so not a surprise that I missed it. But we'll see if uh, Sally will miss it. Yep. Yep. Mm. <laughs> I think I'll just shoot. There we go. Okay, small little chamber here. Probably just loot in here, but still best to be careful. Okay, I do wonder what other abilities Valentine might have. Oh, hello. And... Okay, not goodbye. <laughs> kind of forgot about the... <clears throat> I kind of forgot about the upward spreads. And welcome back, Marco. Welcome back, Marco! Okay, let's take up shop over here, and we'll deal with the lower half of the ship. Mm. Just in case, since these two are rather low on health. Okay, two of them. Wait, we want sniper here. Yeah, that's not going to reach anywhere near there. Yeah, we even need to move down. That should be safe, I hope, on any explosive barrels. That's one dealt with. Let's go there. I am presuming that the blast radius is only on the sides. Okay. okay. Yeah, let's not shoot that intentionally. Yeah, no, we know we've got no shot with him. Not or not no shots that don't risk blowing ourselves up. There. And that's all of them. Which means that the room up here is going to be empty of threats, or should be. Should be, but may have loot. Okay, even the music is dying down. Okay. Still going to be cautious, just in case it was we need to kill seven of seven. But there are actually more on board. Yep, yep, more on board. And my Valentine does loot. And I guess we'll get to see if uh, the blast radius is just one block or one tile next to them. Nope, it's two. Okay, so we were. <laughs> Sally is in the blast radius of that barrel she's next to. Okay, good to know. Yeah, grab the bag of loot. Loot! Bag of loot! 
I think I think most people would prefer a bag of loot than a bag of loots. You could still sell them, but uh, you could probably get more for other things. Well, it depends on the person. Some people would probably be happy to have a bag of loots. Scrapper Sidearm, Tier 2 Utility, adds free action, shoot a projectile that deals 3 damage, 2 uses per mission. That could be really useful. Yeah. Another Scrap Grenade. Okay, we are going to need to scrap something. So, let's scrap the basic pistol. Yeah, we definitely need to uh, move into a space. What do you get? Focus. If sentries don't move before shooting, plus one damage. Okay. Does not work in melee. Makes sense. Yep. <clears throat> How many fingers does he have on one hand? Uh, yes, from the looks of it. No offense, Captain, but sometimes I do miss sailing the seas. I have sailed all three of them, you know. Three? I've never had the chance to see them myself. I only heard stories. It's a sight indeed. Imagine the sun setting over that crystal surface on that large world chunk by the core. <laughs> Too bad the dang royalists control every last gallon of it. Okay, so there's still some life on some of the chunks. Okay. Looking strong there, Ivansky. Glad to be aboard good, aboard good vessel, Captain. Great workshop to keep parts in shape. Very important. Ivansky already strongest, but need to work hard to maintain it. I've been thinking a bit about the past, Wonky. What if we'd done what the Royalist wanted way back then? Just followed orders. That doesn't sound like something you would do, Captain. If we just completed that delivery and not stuck our noses where they didn't belong. Okay, so these yeah, these two used to work for the Royals. We wouldn't be outlaws, but those poor steam bots would have had to endure their work camps instead. You're right as usual, Wonky. But what if we'd never found out that they wanted us to transport prisoners? You made the right call, Captain. I wouldn't have served under you this long if you hadn't helped them escape. It only goes to show that no good deed goes unpunished. Okay, I was already a bit uh, questionable with, <laughs> with the Royalists, how everyone is acting, but yeah, it sounds like they're just a more structured evil. Cargo barge. No. The rumored safety of the mining... Uh, but I have storage, if we can even afford it. Also, the fact that this place right, is what's called what's Lola's... Uh, the fact that this place call, is called Lola's... <laughs> means that somehow... Lady. Can I... Means she Sorry, probably... Well. Is, she somehow got off the planet. Yeah, and I'm about to say the other bar, but it might be cheaper. Okay, because they, they didn't restock the other one here. Oh yeah, then, then it means uh, there's uh, probably a limited amount. Oh yeah, that's what was interrupted. I thought you forgot to go back there, but it might be steeper. Oh, uh, hello, Mosby. Malou again. Putting the farm back together is proving mighty hard work. Uh, oh, he, he has his leg on the side there. I just had to swing by gut and uh, by gaps and you know, put my feet up for a while, but, or his foot up quite literally, <laughs> very literally. Oh dear. Oh yeah. Sorry for interrupting you so much earlier. Uh, okay. Yeah. These don't. These don't refill. Okay. So you have a limited amount of storage space. Oh, so the heck kind of skull is that? Oh, wait. Uh... It's, it's from one of those cre from those uh, creep. Uh, yeah, from one of those uh, beasties from Dig uh, Steam will dig too. Most likely. Okay. The rumored safety of the mining colony is marred by this huge cargo barge. 
Pressure class scrappers protect the gallons in its ravenous hall or in its cavernous hall. Make sure to bring some long range weaponry. Okay. That means the captain. Uh Gabriel. And yeah, let's bring you two. Okay, you get your sniper. This is going to be a bit risky. Uh, you get one of these and one of these. If they oh, actually swap that around. Uh, there. Mm, yeah, I guess you get the other grenade. Oh also. dear. Water is released. Okay. Oh, come on, already? Pedal sticks. The alarm counter is already active. But a distinct tone, I can tell that servers will pop up once it reaches zero. Okay, that's going to be troublesome. Uh oh. Okay. Uh, hmm. Sally, get behind there. Captain. Get it. Actually, that's likely to open up in quite a big room. So, you get behind Sally. Yep, and there's the inspiration. Hmm. Actually, this... Okay, I just uh, I just realized something. <clears throat> Since someone needs to be nearby for the inspiring to work and for uh, Faraday to get inspired as well, if we start with someone next to Faraday, have her shoot first, and then the one next to her move, then Faraday still gets to shoot with the inspire bonus. Possibly, that could work. Oh, uh, hello there. Um... Uh... Okay, we need to hit them from behind. Uh... Do we still have any... Yeah, that's why I wanted to ask if you had any of those. If I throw that too close, it'll get sea brass as well. Also, I, I do like that it now shows how much health they have. Mm. Oh, too early. At least I'd get rid of that one. Uh, um, one hit at least. Uh, what the? Oh. Ooh, that, that's a hard hit. Indeed. How are he? Did a bit of a bad thing. Oh. Oh, and he's, yeah, that, that. And he's blocking the way. Yeah, okay, never mind, he was probably an idiot. He's just tanky as heck and he's trying to actually use his tankiness. Okay, and he has damage reduction on that. Okay, uh... You get up front, because otherwise Sally is going down. Yep. He never mind. Healed? And, yeah, they heal. Okay, I think we found the difficulty spike. Yeah, I guess it makes sense to mainly for they have a wrench. Hmm. 
Okay. I do like that it shows where all of them are. Oh, another one. Yep. Oh, damn it, I forgot to end the turn. Okay, uh, get up high. We are going to have to deal with turrets, but those are probably going to be less of an issue than these. One meleeer. So, yeah, these need to be taken care of from above or behind. Or with a barrel, if possible. Go. <laughs> nice. We really needed a crit there. <laughs> yeah, the crit was a Oi. bit unnecessary. Really? Still not movement for that? Yeah. There. There. Okay, he's going to get a shot off. Yep. Okay, now where are these turrets going to pop off? Hmm. Yeah, that. The big one... Oh, I, I can see where they are. They're on the mini-map. And there. They can't... Okay, they can't attack during their spawning rounds. But it, okay, from the looks of it, they will respawn once the... Uh, if they're destroyed, they... I, I'm, I'm taking a guess here. After another eight rounds, any turrets that are destroyed will respawn. That's what I'm guessing. Hmm. First, let's open that up. move. Actually, did I move? Yes, I moved too far now. Okay, this is going to add end poorly. Okay, good that that missed. Now you... Okay, they only have four health. That is good. <laughs> okay. Sea brass, grab that quick. Oh, it says, I haven't seen any other game using XCO mechanics in a side. Is it, would this come to as a side scroller? Yeah, two D more. Side scroller is oh, more is from just uh, going from one side to the next. Yeah, but it's still, it's... I haven't seen XCOM style from uh, a game like this. The other is comes usually from uh, top over or uh, 3D. Not from the side. Okay, quickly grab all of this. One more round somewhere. Okay, there's something here, yeah. Okay. Yeah, these turrets aren't actually that difficult to deal with. Hmm. Get as far as possible. There. Okay. And yeah, we can just I 
again. I'll push press the wrong button. Too early. Okay, at least at least he's in a good defensible spot there. Nope, oh, and that's the level that's the threat level up. Really too late this time. Okay, bit of a risk. Actually first. Yep. Repair. Repair. And the X is a door. Scrap roar. It falls on his head. Okay. Okay, that's what I thought. If you if you shoot just over their heads, you will shoot up their hat so you can collect it. We did that on accident in the very first level, I think. Where did that go, actually? There it is, all the way down there. Oh, uh, wait. Wasn't there another turret there? Did I accidentally hit that with a ricochet or something? I think you did. You grab the most important thing, the hat. <laughs> okay, dump place to hide, but yeah, no spawns. Uh, sniffle, Marco. That's it. That's it. Uh, okay. Oh, <laughs> perfect little spot. Okay, out of here. Okay, that was a bit of a nasty surprise, but we managed. Okay. Blacksmith Sniper Mark II. All Blacksmith uh, Mark II's marks, uh, yeah, marksmen know that you have to choose between moving and shooting. Can't have both, sorry. Okay, so this is the... I think this is just a more powerful version of the one that Piper has. Oh, Frontier Thumper Mark II. I want to make a complaint about this wider type of explosion, said no one, ever. <laughs> that oh, one's for Ivansky. Uh, also has friendly fire, so we should be careful. Yeah. Hello. Classic Ushanka. Prominent and comfortable with a soft protective inner lining. Sure to meet your every need, be it cold or hot. It, yeah, there, there was one earlier as well with a crown. I. We, I wanted to shoot that one off, but, well, it's a bit hard to with a shotgun. Frontier Shorty... Okay, that's the same that we already have one of those. And Sally's Parts. Scrap through, won't get experience, points, and earned reputation is reduced. Sally's remains will be reassembled back on the ship. Yeah. Hmm. Let's sort this. Let's see, blacksmith's mark. Yeah, that is just an upgrade. So sell that one. Mm. I'm a bit unsure about this one since it won't do any ricochets. A uh, short laser sight. I don't know, though, is that it's a good weapon or not? Like, it's, yeah. it's rare, yes. Yeah, the, 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 the laser sight shows how much uh, or how many times a bullet, a shot will bounce and such. So having a long one on something that doesn't bounce doesn't make sense. Hmm. Okay, let's get rid of this. Uh, do I want to? We can move and shoot with that one. We can move and shoot with this one. Okay, let's sell that one. If we do, we do have to be careful with the sniper shot, since as fun as it is to just bounce a shot all around a ship to kill something, uh, we do need to be lined up for it. So if we need to be more, if we need to be speedier, we need something that doesn't. Uh, well, doesn't make us choose between shooting and moving. 
Yeah. I don't do so this time, but it's understandable. Okay, time to glue Sally back together. Nobody has anything to say. Oh, Sally has something to say. Probably a complaint about getting killed. <laughs> I didn't actually expect there to be a line like this. Good to see you reassembled again, Sally. Wonky did a fine job with it, I see. Would have gone a lot quicker if she'd only stopped screwing about so much, ma'am. <laughs> Next time, start with me arms first. So I can not I can do the rest myself, I bet. Okay. Uh, how much water do we have at the moment? 1,200? Okay, then we can buy one more slot. Yeah, definitely a good idea. Okay. That's all we can get at the moment. All right. Yeah, we're going to need to keep an eye on those shielders or, or whatever they be called. Uh, they're going to be a problem. Turret plants. Our competent captain and our courageous crew uh, should take out the scrap of turret plant. Having fewer turrets around is never a bad idea, and destroying the plant's generator should be a breeze. Emphasis on should. Okay, Mark II Sniper. Let's see. Hmm. Yeah, let's give you a shotgun as well, since you get up close and personal anyway. anyways. Plus, if she gets a kill with this, she can go for another shot, so having her up front would really help. Should we give her a new hat? Let's see. Warm beanie, this knitted extra warm woolen beanie will keep you warm and snug whether you like it or not. Famously worn by gentlebot cat burglar Arsène Le Pain, or Arsène Le Pain, Le Pain, a sucker for hot goods and snuggery. <laughs> Um, let's keep the hat as is. Though I will try to just get more hats off of people. Or bots. Yeah. Three ways to go. Let's see. Okay. You two line up here. Captain at the back. Okay. That's three gunners. It's more up. <laughs> I actually wanted to hit that in the back of the leg, but that works as well. It, wait, you tried to aim for the Achilles heel? Yep, you could say that. Okay, they're going to get a good shot in here. But at least it will one shot and not two. It, or that. Just block damage. Okay. Let's put a round through the throat. Okay. I see some loot in this place, but let's settle up at the doors here. This has to be just one room. Okay. Hopefully. Okay, and it's empty. Okay. Then we move to this one. Nope. Empty as the captain's lunchbox for the lunch. 
Let's grab that. Wait, what did you say then? MTS the captain's launch box after lunch. All right, I thought I, I, thought I said la launch for a moment there. Okay. Oh, hello. The heck uh, are you? All with a axe. You, you, you're an exploder of some sort. Well, uh, booms away. Explosive mark on him. So yes. Viper, move there. That. Okay, then one room remains here. Okay. Let's actually put Sally up front this time. Mm, you can remain there, though. Now let, let's keep Sea Brass at the front since he has the payback thing and all. And he has the most health. So he can be a meat shield or a steam shield. Uh Gunnar. Ride me with a blow towards. How did they get past all my chums? Production mustn't slow down because of some prying cowbots. Luckily I just shipped a full batch of turrets. Speaking of which, have a free sample of my scrapmanship. Activate turrets. Wait, they immediately activate? Or... Okay, no, this, this is the countdown to them activating. That's okay. A, that's a very Swedish name. Gunnar. Okay. Nope. I keep pressing uh, yes, the wrong button to fire here and there. I know in the movie, the was Expendables, there's a sweet name. Gunnar the Gunner. This is a horrible pun. Oh, it's up they are uh, hello. Uh, okay, luckily that they can't uh, shoot on the same <laughs> at the same turn as they activate. They okay, shoot okay, off the uh, You can. Yep. Uh, Sally, can you move closer here for a second? Does this does this double count? Uh, yeah, that that counts on turrets as well. Okay. Ooh. Not a bit too high. Almost took out one of the turrets as well. Okay, we are going to take some shots from those though. Ow. Okay. We'll grab all the loot or just run. We're going to grab it. But first. Oh, no. I guess a chance that the loot give us more slot. There's no way in hell that this is going to hit. Okay, one of them hits. I mean, am. There. Okay. You grab that. Grab that. Okay. There's a turret there that's not active yet, but that one is. So... There we go. <laughs> okay, you get your hat back. Maybe you can be a bit Shut less angry her. then. Uh, 
Okay. Uh, if we do have everything, we do have everything. move you there. We do have to keep in mind that we are fragile. There. I can't bounce the shot off of the underside of the barrel and into the uh, into that one, so let's just go for a direct shot. And no real need to aim. There we go. That's not a wonder. But this purpose, in a way, quote unquote, undead by robot terms? I think so. Okay, and out of here. Okay. Water. Frontier SMG. Okay. And just a bunch of uh, water. Okay. Back. Plus one health. Okay. Okay. The game did a the game did a nice one here. It uh, gave a, a free experience point because well, three hundred and five divided by three would not be two one hundred and two. Though earlier it's. The earlier it's uh, rounded down. Okay. <laughs> Dang, we couldn't foil our supply of turrets completely. At least we now have fewer scrappers to worry about. We're close to that brutal crusher. That's got yeah, that's got taps contacts shivering in their hideouts. Yeah, then let's shiver this timber instead. His timber is that. Uh, anyone get anything new? Nope. I wonder if we'll get any more crew than this. Nope. And that's now available. Let's actually go take a look. The well-groomed lawn is a pure pride for its owner. Good thing we've mo uh, we've mowed down all these scrappers. Backwater Bodega. Hmm, no sign of advertising, but it looks like some kind of store. Whoever is running it has chosen an obscure approach on how to attract customers. Okay. Is some sort of black market deal? Hello. Get busy buying something, will you? Headhunter. Rusty light armor. Plus one health. Rotted and chip are still better than nothing. Okay, so just plain plus one health. And more storage. Oh, there's a large storage unit for oh, four. Four thousand. <laughs> yeah, we would need to grind up for that. Yeah, no, at least for now, no, we may we can do the grinding off screen. Of off steam, I mean. Off stream. <laughs> off -steam. <laughs> oh, poor love of. Uh, Lone Ranger, this tiny vessel should be a one-bot mission. The rest of the queue can put their feet up or do whatever it is Wonky does while <laughs> the crew heists away, since he doesn't have feet. Okay. Yeah, let's go with the captain for this. But we go with one of these. Yeah, let's actually... Mm, I might somewhat regret that. But, oh well. And we also grab the oil. Okay. Ac access to new areas, equipment and crew. Okay. 
Uh, this this one looks even more dilapidated than others. <laughs> okay. Oh, hello there. <laughs> okay, I do like I I like the rag dolling. <laughs> or rag botting? Whatever. Rag scrap dolls? <laughs> rag, rag scrapping, yeah. Or scrap dolls, whatever. It's fun to see them fall apart. If this wasn't a one-bot mission, I would go for well, getting more hats. We use one hats. There. Yeah, by sh I, to shoot, I need to shoot them off of the heads to be able to pick them up. And for that, yeah, I need to. You just, it, you just shot off his hat, uh, hat in the land next to the treasure. Okay, we'll have to check. We'll have to check if that is actually collected because I I think you need to shoot it off whilst they're still alive. Yeah, for are you, I saw the ring that appeared around them earlier appear just around the treasure where they landed. And that's everything. Okay, time to head out. Okay, sweet little mission. There. I'm guessing missions will give less experience on reruns. So speed boots plus. Okay. Plus one move. Water, water. Oh. Frontier Biggie. With an enhanced frame to support its power, this Biggie is an awe inspiring companion when roaming the outskirts. Six damage. It's just, it's just straight up a revolver. A new hack. Damn it. So I was wrong then. Yeah. Um, let's see. Yes, it was a mm. treasure. They were doing that circle thing after all. I'm thinking we either get one. Or we need to get rid of two things. Um. Let's actually get rid of one of these. We can we can give one of them the handgun. And then issue. Yeah, I don't really think we're going to be I'm, I don't think we're going to use uh, movement speed too much. Yeah, like <laughs> this way. I mean like movement speed 2 3 5. Then definitely we will use it, but it's only one. Okay. Yeah. Lower cooldown on power shot, that's going to be useful. Okay. Gotta check the uh, back wait. as well. Uh, you said someone got crushed in the airlock, right? Yeah, that, because there's an arm sticking out. All right, so the, the, the arm was what you meant. Earlier, yeah. you heard you say that I thought you saw someone actually get crushed. Beat the brute. Since no decent or indecent cowbop dare venture out in the colony as it is, someone has to stop this brutal crusher. There's four stars on this. Okay, gather outside the bridge, eliminate the crusher, and get out. Okay. I, I, I say this. Yeah. We, we did say we should uh, start high today indeed, but we could almost debate the return to Riemann, but decide against it. We, we should the captain here deserve a break from Rayman. Yeah, I, I'm thinking we could try to finish, maybe not finish, but continue with it on a weekend evening stream because. Uh, yeah, we found out that you can upgrade your health by breaking cages, or a certain amount of cages. We broke enough to get two extra health, which I think should be enough to get past the uh, the boss rush, and the boss after that, or immediately after. Don't know if we can heal then. And even after that, though, there is another level to go through. 
Oh dear. Uh, yeah, we, we're probably gonna try to just do this on Sunday evening. Uh, Saturday evening we will stream. No, no, Saturday afternoon we will stream. If I got... Did I, am I remembering this right? Uh... Yeah, Saturday will be the full uh, will be the, the four hour stream. Yeah, so so Sunday will be the three hour one. But we will at least give the the three hours a try to finish Rayman off. But it has still just be just the just depending on how the heck the final final boss is. Let's see. Okay, I think this should work with the uh, the sidearm. Okay, and you just take multiple of those. Uh, you already have that. You just take the other grenades. Okay. One time he stands still. I had to do his focus. Yeah. Which is why, well, I gave him the pistol that makes him either move or. Come on! This is just going to be a thing every time now, isn't it? Yep, no. Ten instead of eight. Yep. You're a bit slower. Okay. Actually, I probably should have moved Valentine to that spot. There. Okay, what do we have here? An exploder and a marksman. Yeah, bonus damage if you stand still. First off, though, let's open that up. Doubt we can get a may maybe. Oh, we, actually, we can hit the marksman there with some luck. There we go, <laughs> nine damage. Right between the eyes, I think even, or right into the damn eye. Too close to. Only one, luckily enough, but yeah, I was very worried if we were too close to not, or not, but I guess we were not close to him at least. Yeah. Okay, Valentine. He could have gone way worse. Like, if you were standing between Ooh. those two in a way. Yeah, bad news. Uh, oh. Hello. Holy. <laughs> uh, yeah, no way for him to get a shot down. Actually. Yeah, that was a Hail Mary. <laughs> okay. This is not, though. That's just a spearing headache. Okay. How, how the crew gone feel so far? Uh, better than I thought, and yeah. Having sniper weapons on Valentine that works a lot better since he already gets a boost from not uh, moving. And yeah, firing. I was I was to mention that uh, he does seem to be the best level snipers. Uh, it should not. I should have moved him down instead. Okay, uh, that's a big room. You can't move as much compared. Okay. 
<laughs> okay, this is the bridge. Okay. There. Oh, they need to be up here. Okay. Jim Bob. I'll be darned, a working smorgasbord that offs fresh parts for the grinder. And I just got this new cowbot arm and all. I'll scrap you and our ma will use your awesome uh, her using uh, well, her awesome techromatic uh, powers to raise you back to a new life. In a better form than before. Part of our family, an army of scrappers to rule the waters of the world. Okay, so they are basically zombie robots. Come on, cousins, let's get these puny bots. Yeah, about that. How many, how many times by this point have I accidentally guessed correctly about these things? Uh, plenty. I'm not sure we should uh, dare to do a counter for that. Let's see. I kind of want to take out these first, so there. Okay, he has oh, yes. heal. Uh, actually, we need to steal his hat. First there. I think you can agree, that's a very fancy hat. Yeah, let's see if we can just shoot it off. There we go. Okay. Okay, all treasures do that ring, okay. There. Valentine. There we go. <laughs> Put yourself into a worse position there, dumbass. There. Yoink. Go and Piper catches herself a whale. Okay. okay, we can't go back, so no need to go look for more loot. And oh, I just noticed that the the timer for the the for the turret stopped as well when we got in here. Yeah, don't forget the treasure. Yeah, I, I'm guessing go. if we I'm guessing if we took too long, those turrets would have been active. I would not be surprised that one. Oh well. And the worst more strike around. Th yeah, but we got the boss. Yeah, probably we did not get the 100% though. Grenades. Grenade. 10 damage. Oh, one use, of course. I do like that we get a bit of a hint as to what sort of value we're getting out of these from the particles. Scrapper Captain Hats. An impressive hat generating glances of awe from those less experienced. They don't hand these out uh, they uh, they don't hand out these on a whim, so wearers are probably rugged veterans. Okay, plus one health for someone. But we gotta sell two things. Uh yeah, we can sell one of these. Yeah, I think this one have to, will have to go. Since we already have a sniper and we already have one for the captain. <clears throat> go. Okay, some extra health for Valentine. I do like that the levels come a bit slowly, but they do have... 
Well, was, they do have good uh, upgrades. This Trapper boss has to be stopped. She's raising an army of, from parts of broken cow bots. My goodness, how is that even possible? Wherever she is, she's gotten her dirty witch claws and some sort of power. Takes some great technical prowess to manage what she's done, I'd say. Mixing people's parts like that. No wonder they're all bug nuts insane. We should head back to Taps and see if she's heard anything more about this Techromancer. Techno. <laughs> a techromancer. Necromancer, but tech. tech. Yeah, like, yeah, I heard, I heard of Technomancer, but Tech. I had trouble with pronouncing it, but it's been a little bit different. Oh, I forgot that I was smiling this time. The Royal Space Force supposed to keep the law out here Why we are doing their work. <laughs> they should be handling this crap as long ago as they were reading our tailwind. <laughs> Don't have the divers out there wasting time drilling up the place. We have to clean up for them then after them, don't you find? Ivanski has been called bad names in life, but try to see good in all. Scrappers are making this hard. Taking on Royal and Space Force, that is good. Using powers to raise dead parts is pure evil. Nothing from Valentine. This explains how they get and how they got their volunteers. A steambot needs the freedom to choose their own parts as they grow, to create their own personality. They're slapping together new beings from various parts of cowbots? Mixing already settled personalities can only lead to insanity. Yeah. Okay, back to Lola's it is, ma'am. Okay, that goes pretty fast if you're holding down the stick instead of flicking it each for each <laughs> yeah, for each movement. I recognize that noise. When the world takes around you. Well, sir, this place has gotten lively. What a difference, eh, Captain? Sure is, but I'm afraid it won't last for long. The scrapper army is still growing. We need to take care of their leader, this mother techromancer. Thanks to you, some of my little steam birdies have surfaced again. Word is a large smelter of a bot named Chop Suey is calling the shots in the Scrapper Gang. She has a small chop shop in closer to the core. Well, we need to get. You know, we need to go have a serious talk with her then. Better be careful, Captain. She seems crazy enough to start a war with the Royal Space Force. Oh, hey, Rick. Hello. Myrtle. Are they YouTubers? Yep. What? The singers, they feel like I heard them on YouTube. Okay, could look it up after the stream. Which is actually that long more anymore. Uh, can't go home no more. Not without missing my shipment of at least up there drunk. <laughs> the gang of bug nut ashy uh, scrappers made off with me hold my home trim. It was filled to the brim with supplies for the Space Force. I'll get disassembled for sure if I return without it. Jay, you look like a tough bunch of steamboats. If you can get my train back, maybe we can make a deal about a reward later. If suddenly... <laughs> they suddenly are sobered up. There's actually an explanation mark on the... Uh, Minimap as well when someone wants to talk. Hmm. Never been this close to the core before. It's nothing like uh, farm life in the far reaches of the outskirts. This is more like a vacation paradise. Folk here are soft like tinfoil. The tech romancer can't be that tough if she's, if she's holding out here. Being close to the core is all but safe. You've got the royal space for us right next door. You did it this time! What? 
You say technomancer, but it's a technomancer. It's easy to be said, isn't it? Yeah. Let's go take care of Chop Suey be uh, or Chop Su before she ruins the outskirts. Hmm. I do wonder how close. Oh, that's the train. How close we'll get to the core if it'll just stay in the background like this. Space train. A hijacked space train drifting through the thin atmosphere. Okay, so we're ac we're actually close. We're closer than we seem, at least. I'm guessing then. Uh, it might look serene, but anyone crazy enough to steal a royalist shipment should be handled with care. Okay. Get the epic swag, kill them all. Okay. Yeah, probably the last one for the evening, I guess. Probably. Actually, you keep your hat, and you uh, take the spoils of war. Nope. Okay. Actually... Hmm. Let's sell that, actually, and get the bigger boom. Okay, now, <laughs> now Sally just looks evil with that big maw of hers like that, and the hat. I kind of look oddly like a police for some reason. Oh, uh, hello. Fancy hats all around, it seems. Wait, are those... Are those top hats or buckets? The uh, same, I think. Okay, that didn't help as much. That just damaged our own cover. <laughs> well, that got us a hat and a <laughs> headshot. Uh, they don't really know how to use those things, do they? Uh, we have one eye, so I think there's an issue with the depth perception. Yeah. Okay, there are 17 scrappers at least on board. Okay. You go high. Piper goes low. Hmm. Now that I actually think about it, a uh, Steam World quest probably takes place on one of those uh, planet shards. So I guess that is very much not... Uh... Oh, hello. Taking place before everything went boom. <laughs> that ability of hers is really freaking powerful. Okay, open up. Okay, execute one. And get another one. This almost this almost feels like cheating or bullying them or something. Well they're all insane, so there. Grab that. Get into position. Hello, boys, and goodbye, boys. There, and there. Three of them, okay. First off, that one. Oh, that's... Okay, I didn't see that that was solid. But we still get the other one anyways. 
<laughs> okay. There. Okay, grab that. And yeah, we're getting to the end of the train. Get lost too. Don't even need to aim. Yep. Oh, okay, so the barrels have two health, apparently. But we can't take off your hat. There. Yes, you need to collect the, uh, the hats once. Probably, yeah. yeah we're, well, we don't have really a real need for duplicates. Yeah. So, come on. There. Okay. But way faster than expected. Yeah. I thought that it would take a bit more. Okay. I got food of baby ten, but Hermetic Horror Herring. Hills tell of civilizations that fell to ruin upon opening cans like this. Makes a moist squelching noise when shaken and will hopefully be worth something to someone out there. Right. And it says something yeah. I uh, yeah, yeah, I saw it. So <laughs> strumming! <laughs> we just cannot get rid of this <laughs> we just cannot be rid of this stupid stuff, huh? <laughs> Armored top hats, a hitched up region with a pallet of rivets. Feels uh, comfortably, rig feels comfortably rigged, rigged while promenading in the battlefield like a true gentle bot. <laughs> Some heavy armor, okay. Now, I still don't really think that. Oh, sprint distance. I thought it was movement distance in, distance in general. Okay, that makes it more worth it to get one extra health. Do I have... I would need to compare it to light armor. Mark three heavy thumper. Okay, that means that we can get rid of the... Yeah, of the Mark two. Yes, and we're sending this thing out into the void as well. And we got a lot of that money from that. That's... Hmm. Health plus one. Frodo and Chip still better than nothing. Okay. Oh, this is tier three. I, I was about to say, why would you ever want this over this one then? So, yeah. Scrapping you. I can't scrap it at the moment. Yeah, I, I mean, we, uh, right here, hold we, we learned... Uh... Last time in this in world that the developers are Swedish, and even if we Swedes will admit the true streaming is horrible. And I, I think Sally might be the most powerful character in the game with this. Unlimited kill mm. shots. Okay. Or against oh, uh, rush mobs that they can. It is. Okay. Yeah, two one. Uh, I just noticed a bit more. Uses one permission, adds free action. So that is only for one turn, but still that can, that can be extremely powerful if you can get her into the middle of a group. Yeah. And if it is a group of trash mobs, then yes. That old uh, train driver sure wasn't kidding. These scrappers are insane. <laughs> Seems only fair that we keep one grenade launcher for our troubles. Seems like this chop Sue's turned her shop of horrors into a scrapper factory. I wonder how her smelter got her, uh, like her, got a hold of such powers. Stealing and chopping up ships is one thing, but combining parts of different bots? She might have gotten away with her chop shop earlier, but the Royal Space Force won't ignore this. Okay. Time to harness that rage of yours, Gabriel. 
If this reanimating business is half as bad as I think, we're in for quite a fight. <laughs> yeah, what are we waiting for? Let's kill all the witch. Albagger and Tagger, just like back at the farm. Again, what sort of farm did you folk run? A body shop? A graveyard or something? If there's something left when I'm done with it, yeah, welcome to it. Okay, you call dibs. Yep, Sally has what? something. Yeah, Sally and probably the old guy. Yeah, I see, yeah, I see it on the map there. This is uh, this is just like a big old space track, a uh, space tractor, ain't it? I used to drive one of those all the time back at the farm. Maybe I should pilot the ship for a while, so as y'all can take it easy. It takes years to learn how to you know, pilot the ship like this, Sally. Maybe later then. Okay, Valentine. This tech romancer sounds nasty, don't you find? Doesn't sound all that bad, does it? I'm known as somewhat of a tech romancer myself. <laughs> you got it? Tech romancer? I guess you know we're automatons. Yeah, that's bad! Okay, <laughs> I can like see we've... it. I <laughs> Go ahead. Go on. I, I feel like I did the right choice to voice act C, Brass. Yeah, I was yeah, about to say the same. Right. <laughs> That's quite enough. Wait, does that mean... Jules Valentine? <laughs> maybe, maybe not. For now... Uh, let's actually take another look here. Uh, and we then we we'll call it. Yeah, yeah, for do remember, we have five minutes remaining. It's, we have better than these. Hmm. Yeah, I, I, I think we might actually not need any of the stuff that this guy has. Oh, yeah, Sally really looks like a freaking menace with that hat. Also, 31 out of 51 uh, reputation. That, that gives me a feeling that this game might be a lot shorter than I actually thought it might be. Royalist Drilling Outpost. Royalist Drilling Crew has claimed these cow about asteroids for oil drilling. With this much scrapper activity close by, they're awfully well armed. Maybe leave them be for now. Hmm. Okay, let's move somewhere so that we get a save. Okay. In and out. And there we have our save. Okay. Yep. Always nice again when they show you how long it's been. Uh, <laughs> okay, we might we might actually be able to finish this next time already, uh, unless, like, that 51 gets upped or something, like this is only, like, a first act or so. Hmm. Question, uh, is it the next time or next time again? Yeah, the, the time after that, which means that we'll be moving on to... Uh, Order of Ecclesia quite a lot sooner than I actually thought. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> but for now then, uh, yeah, that's where we'll have to call it for today. So, yeah, before we end the stream, of course, let's go look for someone to raid. So let me remove the always on top. And... Yeah, yeah. Okay, and I just mean, apologize again, Captain, to you for earlier about and I repeatedly interrupted you to try to warn you about the uh, item uh, slot thing. Yeah, no problem. Uh, let's see, we have Tarnish Endeavor, who is playing Elden Ring. Uh, actually, I, I can move this forward since, well, window, not window capture, game capture. For some reason, the Steam World games do not like window capture. <clears throat> and yes, I finally made new scenes for the well, pre-stream with uh, window capture and the main uh, main one with that. I just need to put it into the stream deck still. <clears throat> Anyways, uh, yeah, Tarnish Endeavor with Elden Ring. Jimmy McGinger is playing Chained Echoes. Uh, let's see. What is this? One, it sounds familiar. Okay. 
pixel art, top down or top down slash isometric uh, can be a slight difference. Um, next up, we have Sapphire Cloud playing uh, Sa yeah, Sapphire Cloud playing Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. Profound Madness is also playing Elden Ring. Same for Grim the Wolf. I'm a Flanker is playing Crusader Kings 3. WBPL is playing Fire Emblem Engage. Karen I oop, timer. Karen I with Tabletop Simulator. Kingdom Death Dreamers. Okay. Yeah, I'm not good. <laughs> I'm not too familiar with many board games, so I've never heard of that one. And the last two, we have Halloween with Life is Strange 2. And Touch Kilite with Plate Up. Any of those out of interest or shall I? Hmm. How will you take a pick? Oh, uh, I see something else here. Uh, Invader Tori, among the recommended, who is playing Dave the Diver. Hmm. Let me take a quick peek. Okay, looks like they're pretty early into it. Hmm. Shall we rate them or one of the more usual ones? Uh oh, that's tempting. Hmm. I say uh, we can invade the uh, inv invade <laughs> invade invader. Only, yeah, yeah, raid them unless they have a raid block up. Okay, we'll see about that. So let's copy the name. Go to our place. Slash raid and paste. But before we try to start that, of course, thank you everyone who has. <laughs> that was my uh, headphones case. We're well, not head for earbuds case. Uh, yeah, thank you everyone who has been watching now or later. Uh, thank you, Marco. Thank you, Runners for Life. And thank you everyone who came along with the uh, raid earlier. Uh, th thank you, Jess. Thank you, K Money. Thank you, Do Raid TV. And yeah, of course, thanks, thank you, Jess, as well for the raid. And let's see, any other names? The Silent Dahlia, okay. And that's all the names I see in the chat there, okay. And of course, as always, thank you, Drakir. You welcome as always, my friend, and thank you all for joining, especially, uh, especially, thank you all, regulars, as I say. <laughs> And yeah, uh, no stream tomorrow. And it's a bit unclear at the moment if I need to work on Sunday. So we might be able to do two streams in the weekend. I will check tomorrow. But at the yeah, very for... least, we will be able to do a four hour stream of uh, Digimon Cyber Sleuth on uh, Saturday. Yeah, and if we do stream on Sunday, it definitely will be an evening stream and not an afternoon stream. Yeah, and which will we in which we will try to uh, well continue with Rayman. I think I'm just going to put that one on a low fire because it can be just freaking frustrating. And I think I may have been wrong about one thing with it. If you run out of oh. lives, you do not get sent back to the entire first beginning of the game. So that is at least one uh, <laughs> mercy that that game has on you. <clears throat> okay, but for now, let's get the raid started, and no block, okay, and yeah, thank you all again for watching, and until next time, have a nice day, and until then. Be safe everyone, sleep well, and watch out for space seagulls. <laughs> and scrap bots. <laughs> until next time everyone. <laughs>